Good morning. How's everyone doing this morning? So I wanted to just hop on real quick to talk about something that I thought was really important for me to hear. Um, and so I thought I would share it with you too. And it was around being wrong. Um, I think we've all experienced um, times when we realized that we were wrong about something. And oftentimes um, the response or the reaction to that inside of us is to cover that up, to make excuses, to be defensive, to, to project that feeling onto someone else. No, you're wrong, I'm not wrong, I'm right. And in this polarized world, it happens all the time and it's not very helpful. And I heard someone say something, it's not the first time I've heard it, but I think it just like really got in there, which was, please tell me when I'm wrong, because when I'm wrong, then I can learn something new. And I love that. And it came from, I can't remember the context exactly, but it came from someone who was a scientist. And I, you know, science is based on learning when you're wrong. I mean, that's what the scientific method is. It's trying out different hypotheses and then seeing was the hypothesis correct or not. And a lot of times it's not. It's just a guess, um, a targeted guess, and then you test it out and you see is this true or not? Is this right or wrong? And, and it could seem wrong and then later on it could seem right. So I guess what I'm trying to say here is that scientist, whoever he or she was, I can't remember, really inspired me when he or she said, um, I, I want to be told when I'm wrong because I want to learn something new that I didn't know before. So I'm challenging you and I'm challenging myself to be like that, to be open to being wrong in whatever capacity it is, whether it's wrong about a fact, whether it's wrong about a situation, whether it's, um, maybe my opinion is based on something that's faulty. Um, I really want to stay open to being wrong so that I can learn. And the thing about that too is that, well, if you start doing that, people are going to take advantage of you and they're going to be calling you wrong all the time. I guess what? I think what's really going to happen, and I could be wrong, is that the more open you are to being wrong and the more you learn and the more you get comfortable with that, then being wrong is not a stigma anymore. In other words, you go for what is as true as possible, but you're not so protective around having to be right. And when you're not like that, people respond to that. I mean, some people are, are gonna just always be like, ah, eh, you were wrong, you were wrong, you were wrong, and feel righteous within themselves. However, I think, I predict, that the more comfortable you can be around being wrong, you're not gonna be concerned about that. Whether you're wrong or right, you're gonna be okay. And that makes everyone else feel okay when they're wrong or right, and they're more willing to admit if they're wrong or if they didn't have the whole story. I mean, a lot of the stuff that is going on in the world is we just don't have the whole story. We have part of the story, it seems right to us, we're very dedicated to it, and then there's this other part we don't know about or heard something weird about and we don't exactly understand it and so we dismiss it. And so if we want to get through all this polarization within ourselves and between us as people, we have to be willing to be wrong, to learn, and to be willing to see the bigger picture. So I hope this is helpful today. I am jumping off onto another call, but I just wanted to say that for anyone who needs to hear it, the way that you become okay with being wrong and not being so nervous about it all the time is to realize that when you're wrong, you learn something new. And that is huge. And it doesn't mean that you're a bad person. It may bruise your ego. The ego may feel kind of weird about it, but really at your core, you're, you're fine. And um, when you kind of get over the bruised ego part, you realize, wow, I really learned something new. And then you also realize that You've been doing that since the get-go. You're constantly as, you know, as a small child learning what's what's what and making mistakes and learning something new and being kind of excited about it. So that's what I wanted to say today and I hope you have a great day. And if there's anything that you want to learn 
or you want to know more about or you're having a tough time with and you can't figure it out, just write it in the comments or send me a private message and I'd be happy to talk about it. So I hope you have a great day. I hope this was helpful and don't, don't be afraid of being wrong because it really is a game changer. Okay, take care. Bye.